good delegate must be uh, open, must be uh, open to cultures, mm. because you will be exposed to different cultures, different countries, mm -hmm. different contexts that are outside of your comfort zone. Uh, they have to have realistic expectations. They really need to, to be open-minded. They need to, uh, if you want to be a really good delegate, you also have to have the love for, for, for your neighbor, the, the, the drive to, 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 to do something good. Uh. I think a good delegate needs to be somebody who at his heart is mm -hmm. a very open person. Mm -hmm. Uh, willing and able to learn, mm -hmm. willing and able to question his realities, mm -hmm. um, and being flexible. Mm -hmm. Usually you spend your life living on a plan B rather than a plan A. Um, and you have to be a sociable person as well to a certain extent because you are living and working in, in tight circumstances. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's easier when you get along with your colleagues and housemates. Yeah. And that's just... You have to be able sense. to represent. You have to be able to yeah. address issues that are not easy. Practicality is something mm -hmm. that's really, really important for a delegate. Common sense. You, you have, yeah, common yeah. sense. You have to be able to think in concepts, yeah. but then come to a point and come to a point in time also pretty quickly where you say, OK, this is now what we're doing and where we're going. Exactly, exactly. It's, yeah. uh, it's, it's about being decisive. You know. uh, so, so what we do, what the delegates do, is sometimes they transform a complicated, almost mm -hmm. surreal situation uh, into a practical mm -hmm. solution. You know. you know, to be close to the people while at the same time having the needed mm -hmm. distance to do the mm -hmm. work. Mm -hmm. um, to be able to have the empathy with them that have suffered while at the same time being neutral and not taking side in this conflict uh, are essential tools that can help you um, best represent uh, the interests of these victims who've suffered from, from armed conflict. But sometimes you have to be able to listen. You have to be able to have the humility also to learn from them. Uh, and 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 that's also something that's uh, that's important for 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 delegates. I mean, the flexibility that we ask of our colleagues and of ourselves mm. is also to take on tasks that are maybe not in your daily job. Uh, I think that's part of the team spirit somewhere indeed, that uh, you take on uh, the work as it <coughs> as it occurs, and and uh, you through this contribute to the to the larger cause. Indeed. And last but not least, you have to have a sense of humor sometimes. <laughs> you can't be laughing about everything or joking about everything, but sometimes you have to be able to just, uh, just, uh, just be able to smile. And, uh, because, uh, because when you work for the ICRC, the things that you face sometimes can be, can be very difficult. And, uh, and it, it, it's important to have the distance. Uh, after the day's work, you... you, you you, you take care of yourself. But, um, but at the end of the day, as I always say, there is no place I'd rather work. Uh, you don't work, wake up in the morning asking, uh, you know, another day of work again and shaking your head. No, you, know, you don't ask questions, you know. Every day you wake up, you, 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 uh, you put on your shoes, uh, you know that, uh, that your work will, will somehow have some impact. And, 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 uh, it's it's a great uh, it's a great feeling i think